Alright, so I'm gonna be going over phase 4 of Care Pack, which is the last phase of the boss. So, what you would do when he would get phased is that you would hop into your clone, and you would start doing your Dark Bow, because since I'm using range, you can use Deadshot also. So, after the time warp is ended, you will get him to below half health and let the clone finish it off. And then you will hop to the next one. If you're using the burst of vitality method, you would burst him a little bit and then hop to your other clone, start healing. And from this clone, you would just, you know, you would burst it down. You can get a good heal right there. But try to make sure it's from the main care pack so it gets a bigger heal. So yeah, you would just burst it down till about 10, 15k. But 10, like the lower it is, the better because uh, you'll see later why. So yeah, you would time warp again here. And what you would do is that you would dark bow. You would get adrenaline up to 50%. Use your devotion. And then go back in. So the devotion would uh, extend here so then you would go into the next care pack since it was low enough it died already so it gave us an extra extension you would hop to the next one get an, another extension and then if if you don't get it you can use devotion again kill it and get a, an extension off of then so from here you get a big old res continue to burst down care pack death swiftness uh, then you would use the other defensives in the time warp and you would just burst it down dark bows your best friend uh, spiritual potions uh, For your familiar dread nips oh, let's go. Yeah. And That's it